So whenever you're out taking corners, you want to stay zero throttle until your steering and your lean angle are completed. So let's say you're going down the road at 50 miles per hour and you want to slow down to 30 miles per hour to take a right-hand turn, right? So you're slowing down, you're, rolling, you're off the throttle, you're on the brakes, downshift, whatever you need to do. But once you go to turn the bike, so you counter steer, so you push right to make the bike lean to the right, push right, go right, or pull left. Counter steering is the same thing, pushing right or pulling left, same thing. Either way, counter steer, so zero throttle, push right to go right, the bike will lean, and once your lean angle is done and your steering is completed, then you could crack open the throttle a little bit. And it depends on the type of corner. If the corner is done, like a 90 degree turn, if it's done right away, after you turn the bike, 0% throttle, you crack it open. Well, the bike is already facing the right direction. You can start to stand it up and stand the bike up and accelerate out of there. If it's a big 180 degree turn, you have to wait a little bit longer. So you're rolling off the throttle, 0% throttle, you're coming down into it. Make the bike turn, right? Push right, go right, the bike will lean. Once your lean angle is done, like you're at the right amount of lean you need to make the turn, and all your steering is completed, right? Keep on, you push, 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 push until you're at the lean angle you want, and then you can kind of relax the push a little bit. So once the steering and the lean angle is completed, then you could crack open the throttle a little bit just to maintain the speed. That's why it's called maintenance throttle. Then just to maintain the speed until you get all the way through the corner, through the corner, through the corner, through the corner, you're waiting, you're waiting, you're waiting. Then finally, once the bike is facing the right direction, and you could start to take away the lean angle and stand it up, then you could actually accelerate up and out of the corner. You don't accelerate until you could see where you're going, and you could start to take away the lean angle. The bike has to be facing the right direction in order to accelerate. So this is the whole idea. Here's my throttle. See that? As it stands up, you're rolling on the throttle. But wait to crack open the throttle until your steering and lean angle are completed.